Hi, I'm Andy Legrand. Welcome to our program. Today, we're going to carry the torch for safety. Every day, welders in various industries use high temperatures to shape metal. Sometimes the metal is bonded together, other times it's cut apart. Over the years, engineers have developed a variety of methods for welding. The combination of a spark, oxygen, and a flammable gas provide the energy for oxyfuel cutting, welding, and brazing. High voltage electricity whether it's alone or used in tandem with various gases, powers arc welding. Because of the heat and the materials involved, these welding methods can all be very hazardous. But no matter which type of welding you're working with, there are things that you can do to make your work safe. The first thing to do is to inspect your equipment. When you're working with an oxyfuel unit, make sure your torch has the right tip for the job at hand. Examine the cylinder valves and fittings. These must be clean and clear before you connect the torch and hoses. Once everything's set up, apply a soap solution to check for gas leaks. Some problems can be solved by simply tightening the connection. Arc welding units also need to be checked out. Inspect the frame of the generator for proper grounding. Make sure the work lead and electrode lead are properly connected. And don't forget to examine cables for damaged insulation or bare conductors. If left unrepaired, these can cause a severe shock. 